How you doing? This is the new way, new way. Uh, welcome to this next video. Um, now, uh, this one is actually going to be a little bit more of the uh, thing I wanted to try. Um, I wanted to try to do a podcast uh, questionnaire uh, video. So, um, just to let you know, this isn't being sponsored by anything. I don't have any kind of sponsorship uh ideas or deals or whatever the case it's it's not what this is about um, I honestly thought about doing it as a you know a fun little thing now I have done questionnaire videos in the channel um, so you know it's it's kind of a repeat uh, but I uh, mean personally I um the reason why I decided to do this one is because I kind of wanted I always liked answering those kind of questions and I like us to give us specific answer now uh, certain answers I'm sure you if, if you have watched the other question or videos the, the the answer is I don't know it, it it's kind of the the it's 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 me being honest it's a shit answer trust me but it I know but but it's me it's the honest it's it's the most honest I can be so that's that's also one thing that um, I also want to keep with with this channel as best I can is I want to be as honest as I possibly can so um, I'm not gonna allow um, a kind of um, I, I don't want to have any kind of you know I, I don't want any crap I just want to be able to be honest with you so that's what I'm gonna do um, so okay so here we go um, I pulled up a website just a wet random website uh to, with some questions so now podcast normally is supposed to be from what i've seen is just questions and then talking but because there's nobody here obviously it's just going to be me talking so excuse me so i'm just going to have the questions read them out and then i'll give a small little story whatever the case i'll keep it going and then later i'm going to show you i'm going to show you some things and then keep keep you uh, I'm going to show you some things. So here we go. Uh, okay. Uh, there's questions here. There's categories, I think. Okay. Okay. Uh, they're just questions, I guess. So categories. Who, how would you like to be remembered? Um, I don't think I want to be remembered, but uh, this is something that I did say in the last videos that I made. Um, I did do this to put something in the Puts, so you can have something on the side so whenever you're doing something you could just have something to listen to I really feel that that's the mm, not the new thing but it is the thing that really helps uh, get things done sometimes if you're someone like if you're someone who, who can work better with noise I, I would be happy to be your noise uh, you know I'm not gonna be too loud I'm gonna be just I'm gonna be just enough so you can you know get the work done or whatever the case that's how I honestly feel but remember Excuse me, remembering, um, you don't have to remember me, honestly. When I'm gone, um, it's going to be tough for the people who, who know me best. And I'm sorry for that, but I don't want you to, to fret. I just want you to keep going. So, and hopefully, after I'm gone and you're still here, hopefully we'll see each other again. You never know. You never know what, what, what will happen. So, here we go. Uh, next question. When did you f first fall in love? When did I first fall in love? It was definitely... It was when I was younger. Mm, it was when I was younger, but... It wasn't, it wasn't real love. It was just puppy love. Uh, what that means is just... It's cute. It's it's nice, and and the person who was with you or who was with me was is a good person from what I from what I can from what I feel and what I can say, but it was it was just puppy love. Honestly, that's how I, yeah. So it, it could be argued that I've never been fully fully in love, which could 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 is probably true, but that's how I honestly feel. Um, how has your life been different than what I what you imagined? I don't have an answer to that question. I'm sorry to say I different than I imagine. I never imagined a, uh, a specific thing. I never imagined myself being among the stars or being, you know, and I don't mean stars as in 
California stars or anything like that, but I mean stars is in the, I, I don't have that kind of, um, I don't have that kind of air around me. So, sorry, I can't answer that too, too honestly. Uh, who has been, that, that's a weird question. I'm just going to skip that one. Okay, uh, let's see. Great questions for anyone. So, here we go. Let's, let's do it. Uh, okay. Uh, question. Uh, can you tell me about the important people in your life? That's my family. Uh, they're the most important. So it's my sisters, my old man and my, and my mom. My, my dad and my mom, I mean, I'm sorry. My mom and dad. Uh, my aunts, uncles, uh, grandparents, uh, anyone who 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 think about me and not, and not want to throw a rock at me. You know what I'm trying to say? They did those are the most important people in my life. Uh, what have what have been some of the happiest moments of your life? The saddest? Well, there's plenty of sadness in my life. I won't deny that. Uh, but there's also very a lot of happiness too. Um, there's situations. There's things that have happened to me. There's things that I've experienced. There's things that I wish were different. Um, to some extent, not not through an imaginational situation, but I mean. I wish things were a little bit different, but in the end of the day, it's not, you know, it's, it's the way it is. It's tough, but there it is. Um, who has been the biggest influence in your life? What lesson did that person or these people teach you? I don't have an influencer. Uh, I don't have that kind of situation. And that person didn't teach me anything because that person isn't there, here. So, sorry to say, but that's the honest truth. Can you tell me about a moment when a person's kindness made a difference in your life? Um, well, one immediately popped in my in my mind when I was a bit younger in high school. There was, I uh, the, 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 some of the people I was with, they they gave me something to fit in, uh, not to fit in, but to be with them. Uh, they gave me a very cool present, which I still have to this day, and. Uh, just it's a very happy thing and I'm glad that I still have it and I'm glad that it's not gonna go away yeah, not if I can help it so here we go um, what what are the most important lessons you've learned in life well there's a lot obviously but one of the most important ones is don't change because everyone else is or if everyone else is going left don't worry about going right. It's not a problem if you go right or opposite. If everyone's going right, don't worry about going left. It's going to be a little tricky. It's going to be a little tough, but don't worry about that. And and, and if you don't have the quote unquote su quote unquote support that you want or you think you should have, I've got your back. Um, if you want to, you know, if if you want to, what, what's what, what, what? I heard a phrase once. If nobody else believes in you, just know that I believe in you. You know, so I'll, I'll borrow that quote if I may. If no one else will, I will. So screw everyone else. You know, you know, try to try to take in the positivity that you possibly can from others. That doesn't. Sorry, I said screw them, but just be you. And if no one else, if no one wants to allow that, just know that I will. And who the hell am I, right? But still, that's what I'm trying to say. Um, let's see. Uh, what is your earliest memory? Um, uh, what? <laughs> what is your earliest memory? Um, I can remember playing hide and seek, uh, with some, some of the kids around the neighborhood where my grandmother used to live, where my grandmother lived, where my grandparents lived. I remember playing hide and seek there. Uh, there was a lot of memories from there that I can, that are now popping into my head right now as I'm bringing this up, but... I can remember that. I can remember playing hide and seek, and I was maybe six, seven at the time. I don't remember. Well, actually, there's a lot more earlier memories than that. I remember being in the hospital uh, when I was when I was old. When I was younger, I was a bit um, sick. Um, it wasn't fun, but you know, what, what are you gonna do? But uh, I was sick, and to some extent, I'm 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 better. But whatever the case, but um, yeah. So I remember that too, being in the hospital. Was, you know, I remember that. So, okay. Um, are there any funny stories your family tells about 
you that come to mind. I don't know if they tell funny. I don't. I've. I've never been in the room if they've told funny stories. So all I'll say is, I hope whatever story they do say of me, tell of me, is at least a good one, whatever that means. So, um, are there? Well, I do have bad stories, obviously. But but, yeah. Are there any funny stories or memories of or characters from your life you want to tell me about? Wait, is this some sort of? Is this a dating one? Oh, this is a dating one. Oh, okay. Okay, I, I screwed up. I, this is a dating one. Okay, my mistake. Um, all right, apparently this is a dating one. Okay, um, whatever the case. Um, <clears throat> any funny stories, memories, or characters of, from your life you want to tell me about? Now, <clears throat> there's plenty of people that I've, I've uh, met and they've left or... You know, whatever the case, I don't mean they passed, but I mean they, you know, they left my bubble. Uh, my, there's a lot of characters that I could talk about. Trust me, there's a lot of them. But all, all I'll say is that I, I appreciate the moments I've seen, and I appreciate the things that I've seen, and I appreciate the fact that I can have, I can have the moment of sitting down watching them again or seeing them again or re reading about them again and it just it's just it puts a smile on my face excuse me what are you proudest of the pro i'm proud that i that i learned the lessons that i learned to some extent and i'm proud that i i've always been the backup of people so that's my honest answer. Not to everyone, obviously, but, but you know, what I mean is that the people that I'm with, I try to be as, as, as a backup to them as best I can. But when I say not everyone, that means everyone outside of my family zone area. I, 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 I can't do it to everyone because I don't know everyone. But that's my proudest thing is that I tend to be a backup for everyone else to some extent. Now, it's it's everyone's got their opinion on that and that that know me at least i'm sure they 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 uh they know the the their percentage of, of that but that's what i'm proud of that i i've learned to be a good backup for people i don't know if that's a good thing or not but that's how i feel uh when in life have you felt most alone there's been moments i won't lie there's been moments where i felt alone but uh, what are you gonna do just you gotta keep going. You gotta you gotta make sure you're there for the people that need you. Um, it's gonna be tough. It's gonna be very tough, and there's gonna be a lot of there's gonna be a lot of um, quiet moments. But honestly, don't um, don't um, don't count out the uh, alone moments too. Don't count them out so much, because um, at least in my opinion, because. Um, they really they really can give you the time and the 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 the, the air of who you are those are long time moments in my personal opinion okay if you could hold on to memories for your from your life forever which would they be i mean i do have memories and there are some that are actually funny enough when i was with my sisters uh, a while back maybe maybe two months ago maybe a month ago we were talking we were in the car together and we were talking she was um my one of my sisters was asking me if i remembered something i said i didn't remember i wish i could i wish i could um not hold on to them forever but i wish i am able to go through the files in my brain and as soon as that memory is being told to me i can snap on snap to it immediately that's what i honestly wish um how has your life been different than what you've okay okay that's how would you like to be remembered that already answered do you have any regrets um yes but they're not huge i've i've regretted some of the choices i've made i've, re, I've regretted some of the conversations that i've had i've regret some of the choices that i made whatever the case i i've I, there has been regrets um but just know that whatever regrets I'm, I may have done have never been from a bad place. Have always been from the person who didn't know better to some extent. That's how I feel. So, 
what does your future hold? Not sure. It could be electronically uh, advanced. It could be, it could be a bunch of stuff. You never know. But me personally, I just, um, I want to be around it for as long as I can. That's my honest truth. Now, if you know what I was looking at right now, you wouldn't be saying that. But still, you wouldn't be thinking that. But that's what I honestly hope. I, I wish that I'm, I'm around for a while. A good, a good long while. That's, yeah. <laughs> At least that's my hope. Um, what are your hopes for the future holds for me? I, I already said that, sorry. What are your hopes for your kids? Well, well I've been going back and forth about this in, uh, for the last couple of years. I keep thinking that I want to, I did, I did make a video once about the kids, the possible kids that I might have, but to be honest, there's been a, there's been a little bit of a, um, what's the right word, what's the right way to say it? Maybe, maybe certain family branches need to stop. I'll just say that. I'm just saying it from my perspective, not, not yours. I'm saying it from my perspective. Maybe they need to stop. Maybe. Um, but if, if I get lucky enough. And if I get out of my, if my, if I get, if I take the stick out of my ass, I want my kids to know that I'll be there for them. That's what I honestly hope. Um, is there anything you never told me, but you want to tell me now? Yeah, I didn't know this, this was a dating channel or dating website. So, okay. Uh, are there things about me that you've always wanted to know, but I've never asked? I don't know you. If you could talk to a younger version of yourself, what would you say? Keep going. That's what I'll say. Keep going. Keep going. Well, what are your first impressions? What are your first impressions of me? How did they change? Well, I didn't think you were this, but then now that I know, they've changed. Okay. Uh, this is this is seriously just dating. Okay. Where will we be? Okay, hold on. This is okay. This is seriously just dating site. Um, okay, there's a few stuff, I guess. I, it's it's weird. I didn't notice it, and now it's categories, and now it's just you know, it's it's one topic, and then questions about that topic. So it, this is about school now. School. Did you enjoy school? Yes and no. Uh, there's been there were problems, but but I did enjoy it overall. It was it, there's some memories that I can I can um, I can remember just a little bit of, and I'm glad to do, have that. What kind of student were you? I was. I mean, I was I wasn't horrible, but I wasn't great either. I guess that's my honest thing. I wasn't you know I, I wasn't loud or anything fully, but but I was just a person. I was just a kid, just trying to. Go through school. I didn't like it sometimes, and certain times I wish I was home sleeping. But yeah, uh, what would you do for fun? What did you What did you do for fun in school? Uh, I guess just be around people and as best I could anyway. And um, I don't know PE. Maybe that was fun. The physical education was always fun. It was tiring, but it was fun. How would your classmates remember you? Um, I don't know if that's a, that's a, that's a bit of a loaded question, but <laughs> I don't know if, if, if they want to remember me in a positive way or a negative way, that's up to them. I'm, I'm not going to stop them, but I hope they at least know that it wasn't, it wasn't anything intense, in, intentional. It was just me being, me being a young, young whippersnapper, just trying to make it, trying to make it through high school. If I did the wrong thing, or if I said the wrong thing, or if I did the right thing, or did the wrong, did the said the right thing, it wasn't uh, false. It was me. Uh, whatever good or bad you want to take away from that. Uh, are you still friends with anyone from that time of your life? No, no, I'm not. Uh, nothing personal, but I'm not. No. Uh, do you have any favorite stories from school? 
I don't know if they're my favorite stories, but there's there's stories. Yeah, there's uh, there's a lot of stories, uh, and I don't want to disrespect anyone's uh, memory of high school. I don't want to scare anyone from that. I, me, everyone, every generation has something. Every year has something different, has experienced something different, and that's that's the honest truth. I don't want to get, go too much into details, but yeah, there's plenty of stories I, I would go through. Um, let's see. Okay, this is about love and relationships. This is going to be a long video, by the way. Uh, do you have a love of your life? No. I love my folks and all that, but my sisters and all that, but no, I don't have a... When did you first fall in love? Didn't. Can you tell me about your first kiss? Yes, it was a dare. And if she, if the person who watches this video remembers that, she dared me to do it. So it was my first kiss. I'm not there. Uh, what was your first serious relationship? I had relationships, but nothing was serious, serious. So I'm sorry to say. Who would want to do this? Just this jackass. Okay. Uh, do you believe in love at first sight? Yes and no. Um... I believe that the appearance will be a factor, but it's not the main thing. It's definitely not. It's not even the top ten. It's it's there, but it's not the. You want to get to know the person. Be be you know you want to get the per. You want to get to know the person underneath the clothes. And I don't mean just physically, but I mean get to know them uh, spiritually, emotionally, whatever the case. That's how I feel. Um, do you ever think about previous lovers? Don't have a lovers, but I've had previous girls in my life and yeah there's a little bit of thinking about them but nothing nothing too much i can't i can't say it's not easy because it's not but that's how i feel um what was the hardest breakup you ever had to experience um it wasn't a hard breakup specifically but it was it was difficult it was difficult it wasn't easy but you move on right um Okay, uh, da, da, da. Okay. these are weird ones, man. Weird topics, seriously. Uh, what? Uh, okay, this is about serious illness. Now, this one actually caught my eye because there was a question there that caught my eye. Uh, do you think about dying? Are you scared? Yes, I have said this before. I am scared of dying. Do I think about it? I do. Excuse me. I do think about it, but um, huh. I do think about it, but it's it's not the um, it, I do think about it, but it's not the topic uh, every single day. But I do think about it from time to time. How do you imagine your death? Honestly peaceful not 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 bloody not not full i mean it will be blood but i mean <laughs> i mean i want it to be as peaceful as possible not uh horrible you know i want it to be and if it is horrible fine but i want it to be as peaceful as possible um do you believe in the afterlife yeah to some extent yeah there is something if there is something there then yeah why not i mean What's wrong with what's wrong with believing that? There's nothing wrong with saying, "Hey, you know what? There's always the same. Death is a, is always the next adventure." A couple of people have said that in the past. Then yeah, if death is the next adventure. Then let me uh, let let's go. Let's do it. Do you regret anything? Um, there's regrets, but you there's regrets, but you can't just live in the past to some extent with those regrets you want to learn from them but you want to you don't want to do that so you want to go a little bit forward um let's see no 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 well this one's going to be a little bit too much okay so okay this is all right i guess that's it Hold on. I'm going to do that. Okay, so I guess that's it. Uh, there's other questions, obviously, that I skipped over, but I, a little too on the, on the nose. So here we go. Uh, okay, here we go. Let's do this, first of all. Okay. So, okay. 
So, uh, the thing I want to do with this uh, second video is I'm actually going to do a small little uh, um, run around around the room where I'm at, where I'm living, where I am. So, I'll, I'll, I'll do that. Um, so, get ready to see the the sanctuary, I guess, whatever the case. So here we go. So here we go. You can see it. I'm gonna go as I'm gonna go as fast, but as slow as as, as fast and slow at the same time. So here we go. This is the time. These are the paintings that I've got. Some of the paintings. That curtain right there is to help me sleep because uh, night curtains, from what I'm told, they really help with the sleep. So that's gonna stay. I got some paintings. Got some old TV. This is one of my favorite ones, by the way. One of my favorite paintings right here. So that that paper towel, by the way, is because when you're living in a uh, underneath the house, there's a lot of spider webs, a lot more than you can imagine. So here we go. So there's some. This is my one of my shelves. There's this little guy. I love this guy. Love Pikachu. Really like Pikachu a lot. And there's actually a quote that uh, I got from my uh, I believe it was crap. What was it for? But it was my sister. She gave it to me. So you can see it right there. I'll, I'll read it to you. I'm not responsible for what my face does when you speak. And she gave it to me because she kind of knew who I was. Uh, this right here is the Bulgarian flag back there. There are my keys. This is one of my, this is my calendar. I know, but the, the, it just, I thought about why not. Let's, let's, let's add a female, let's add a female perspective to the room. You know, that's, call me whatever you want, but that's what I feel. Those two hands right there is actually from uh, my sister. She used to be in this room a while back, and she actually put those up there. And, you know, it's... I honestly... Um, here. I don't know. I'm sure, obviously, her hands have grown, grown bigger over the years, but this, this is also one of my other ones. And then there's... Hold on. There's Harley Quinn over there. And then there's one of my bathrobes, so sorry about that. But there's Harley Quinn over there. I really like her. <clears throat> so, it's funny enough... And uh, there's Alex. How are you doing, Alex? So I wanted to do something. Ah, uh, okay, hold on. I wanted to compare it. Obviously, a little bit bigger now. I'm sure her hands have gotten bigger over the year, over the years. I'm sure it's if it's the same, it's the same. If it's not, it's not. Um, and this is actually pretty cool too. I believe this was my sister's, but she had different lights, kind of like a disco thing. You know, blue, red, green, all that stuff. It's very cool. So that's it. Um, what else did I didn't I show? It was this guy, this painting. Who's this guy in the mirror? <laughs> uh, well, this is one of my favorite ones too. Oh, faint, ah, that, that, painting. Ah, come on, paintings. Here we go. You've seen it plenty of times in the videos. Then there's the there's Pikachu again up there. Bulgarian flag. Um, I guess that's it. Oh, and one more thing I want to show you. I got my little vent over here. Because uh, in this room it gets a little bit hot. So, um, okay, so that's it. Oh, right, I forgot to show you. Hold on. This is actually. Uh, crap, okay, hold on. This is actually one of the things I found through uh, one of the stores. This is actually one of my favorite things. Check it out. It's a mermaid lamp. With the little, what do you call them? The, the little things that with, has a fan in it. So it runs on batteries. It's pretty cool. Um, okay. Turn off. Uh, I really like mermaids. I think mermaids are um, very cool creatures. There's the, I believe the first time I originally saw mermaids was in the old um, show Charmed back in the day. I believe that's when I first saw mermaids, and then the Pirates of the Caribbean on Stranger Tides. Uh, when I saw the mermaids there, that, that, that those are pretty cool. So I, I like mermaids. Okay, um, I guess that's it. And I guess that's it. So have fun. Uh, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And um, here, I'll, I'll, I'll sit back down. And I guess that's it. <clears throat> There we go. And that's it. That's the quote unquote bubble. So, um, you know, think of me what you will. Say whatever you want. I, uh, I'm not going to stop you. 
um, just know that this is me. This is me, and I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna let it become anything else other than me, um, as best I can, anyway. So I guess that's it. Mm, have a good one. Thanks for watching, and um, take care. Bye.